A new community outreach program will take place this summer. We spoke with Police Chief John Schlittler and Officer Ryan O'Leary to find out all about it. Junior Police Academy is a pilot program that we've come up in conjunction with um, the Needham Youth Services. And what it is, is we're trying to um, get into the community with our, and be with our kids and, and let them know what the, the police do on a, on a daily basis, but also have some interaction with the youth um, in terms of trying to build positive relationships and have positive interactions. Because um, we want to have that foundation for community trust. And, and by doing this, we, the, the youth are able to see us in a different perspective. I mean, I'm sure they see a lot on TV regarding what police officers do, but this is really going to give them a hands-on experience in, in what we do and how we do it. The Junior Police Academy is for rising middle school students and rising 7th, rising 8th graders. It just gets the community involved, the youth involved with different things, educate them on things that the police are doing, whether it be the different programs that we have, um, but also basically just to get build a relationship between the community, especially that age group, and the police here in town. We'll have some uh, handcuffing demos, some fingerprinting uh, photograph mug shots. We'll be having a canine dedum by the uh, canine demonstration by the Norfolk Dedham Sheriff's, um, and then we'll also have a Metrolex SWAT uh, demonstration and, and an obstacle course for the kids to, to go through, um, and then we'll have our detectives. Um, go through some, uh, you know, how they process a crime scene, have them look at a kind of a, a, a makeshift crime scene and, and see how they go through it. Um, and we'll also have a tour of the Norfolk County uh, Sheriff's Department Jail, which is up in Dedham. Um, so, and th those are the things that we're looking to do. Um, it is a pilot program, so we're, you know, this is what we've established, we feel, be a, give them a good foundation of, of what the law enforcement does. There's going to be a number of officers that are come through and teach different classes as well as people who are there every day. So it gives the kids in the community a chance to know somebody within the police department. They'll know somebody by name. After that week, they get to know all the different programs that the police department can offer. Um, in addition, it's just going to be a fun week, different activities, keep kids active throughout the week and something to do for the summer. It's June 26th through the 29th. It's Monday through Thursday. It's going to be located at the Pollard Middle School from 9 a.m. to 1.30. It's a free camp that we are offering, so they're all the only thing they have to do is register. Sign-ups begin May 1st, and you can sign up through the youth services. So if you go to the Town Hall website, go into the youth service um, web page there, all the sign-up information is going to be on there. Well, I think when, when I first took over, I wanted to... Um, be more proactive in terms of our building in, and fostering relationships in the community. And the youth is one of, you know, it's one of our more precious um, groups in town and we wanted to reach out to them and establish good communication, um, good interaction and, and uh, you know, positive communication between us so they understand that I'll, although we are police officers, we're here to help them and that we're approachable. Um, and we have the community's, you know, best interests in mind. And we felt that this was a good way for them, for not only the, the kids, but for the police to interact with the youth and, and develop those relationships, which studies show that if you, if you foster positive relationships with the youth early on, that that will, will turn around and, and those will continue to grow as they, go, as they grow up and, and go through the schools.